11th James Knox Polk. 11th President of the United States of America was called James Knox Polk. He was born on 2nd November 1795 in Mecklenburg, North Carolina. He rose to power in 1845 at the age of 50, being the youngest to have been sworn in by then. His wife was called Sarah Polk. Polk was a lawyer by profession. Before becoming president, he had previously served as the governor for Tunisia. He kept his promise of being a one-term president. Therefore, he left office in 1849 and died three months later at the age of 54. Twelfth was Zachary Taylor. Twelfth president of the United States of America was called Zachary Taylor. He was born on 24th November 1784. He rose to power in 1849 at the age of 65. His place of birth being Barbersville, Virginia. He was a military officer by profession. His wife was called Margaret Smith Taylor. He stayed in office for a period of 16 months, becoming the second USA head of state to die while still in office after President Harrison in 1841. By the time of his death, Taylor was 66 years old. Thirteenth was Millard Fillmore. Thirteenth President of the United States of America was called Millard Fillmore. He was born on 7th January 1800 in the Figure Lakes area of New York State. He ascended to power in 1850 after the death of President Zachary. At that time, he was 50. His wife was called Abigail Fillmore. He was a lawyer by profession. Fillmore left office in 1853 and later died in 1874 at the age of 74. 14th, Franklin Pierce. 14th President of the United States of America was called Franklin Pierce. He was born on 23rd November 1804 in Hisbra, New Hampshire. He rose to power in 1853 at the age of 49. His wife was called Jean Appleton Pierce. He left office in 1857 and later died in 1869 at the age of 65. 15th, James Buchanan. 15th President of the United States of America was called James Buchanan. He was born on 23rd April 1791 in Cove Gap, Pennsylvania. He ascended to presidency in 1857 at the age of 66. Before becoming president, Buchanan had previously served as the 17th USA Secretary of State in the Senate and also in the House of Representatives. He was a lawyer by profession. Unlike the other presidents, Buchanan remained a bachelor in his entire life. He left office in 1861 and later died in 1868 at the age of 77. 16th, Abraham Lincoln. 16th President of the United States of America was called Abraham Lincoln. He was born on 12 February 1809 in Hardin County, Kentucky. He rose to power in 1861 at the age of 52. He was a lawyer by profession and had previously served in the House of Representatives. Lincoln's death was through assassin's bullet on 14th April 1865, becoming the first president to die in such way and the third to die while still in office after Henry Harrison in 1841 and Zachary Taylor in 1850. His wife was called Mary Lincoln. By the time of his death, Lincoln was 56 years old. 17th, Andrew Johnson. 17th President of the United States of America was called Andrew Johnson. He was born on 29th Deck, 1808 in Raleigh, North Carolina. He became president in 1865 at the age of 57, immediately after President Lincoln's demise. His wife was called Eliza Johnson. Johnson left office in 1869 and later died 
1875 at the age of 67. 18th, Ulysses S. Grant. 18th President of the United States of America was called Ulysses Grant. He was born on 27th April 1822 in Point Pleasant, Ohio. He ascended to power in 1869 at the age of 47, becoming the youngest to have held that office by then. His wife was called Julia Grant. Grant left office in 1877 and later died in 1885 at the age of 63. 19. Rutherford B. Hayes. 19th President of the United States of America was called Rutherford B. Hayes. He was born on 4th October 1822 in Delaware, Ohio. He rose to power in 1877 at the age of 55. He was a lawyer by profession. His wife was called Lucy Hayes. Rutherford left office in 1881 and later died in 1893 at the age of 71. 20th James Abram Garfield 20th President of the United States of America was called James A. Garfield. He was born on 19th November 1831 in Mollard Hills, Ohio. He became president in 1881 at the age of 50. However, his presidency was to last for a period of six months only due to assassination. Becoming the second head of state to die in such a manner after President Lincoln in 1865, also the fourth to die while still serving after President Henry Harrison in 1841, Zachary Taylor in 1850, and now Lincoln in 1865. His wife was called Lucretia Garfield.